we continue to stay in the uh, forest zone of Cameroon and we are meeting uh, officials of forestry and wildlife uh, and they'll be telling us uh, details about this uh, new strategies by the government of Cameroon to better manage our forest. We are with the divisional delegate for um, Bangem uh, out here, Mr. Thomas Amin, who will be giving us um, why the interest of the government to better manage the forest. Yeah, you know, formally this concept was not very, say, this is very new concept. Formerly, the villager always thought the forest, everything forest was government. And there was this uh, government aspect of policing. Foresters were uh, used to police. But now the government realized that these people were very, very ignorant of the fact that the forest is, is theirs and is part and parcel of their, their livelihood. So the government had to come out to the, come up with this uh, concept of co-management. There is the government and the local community. So what are you, I mean, telling the people no, who are, are in the forest zone? Yeah, we are telling the people to, that they should know that this forest is theirs for today, for now and the future. So all they need is to take care, manage it well for their own good. All right. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Mr. Amin Thomas, for giving much. us this information. We continue to stay with the authorities concerned about forest management in our community. Uh, we're going to meet um, uh, Mr. Uh, Bakia Mo Achankep. Uh, I mean, you actually down in the field, down in the grassroots. Um, what is the relevance of better managing our forest? Uh, you see, the government has a policy that at least 30% of the entire uh, land in the country remains forest. And this is because we have a lot of benefits from the forest, both um, financial and environmental. First, uh, from the environmental point of view, uh, we see that uh, most of our rivers, our streams, comes from the forest. For example, we have the Maninguba area and the Kupe area, they are all uh, proposed integral ecological reserves and we see that all the streams uh, going to the western region, the southwest and even the Toral. And for example, we have the, even the cross river that takes its rise from the Bakosi mountains. We have the Mongo river that takes its rise from the Bakosi mountains. So we see that it is a major source of our, the, the forest is act as the water catchment for the, most of the rivers. And also, we see that it helps to ameliorate the environment. We've been hearing of the cli of climate change, and it is because of the devastating rate of uh, de uh, deforestation in our area. The rate of uh, forest clearance is increasing at an alarming rate, and with the increasing demand for agriculture, we see that if we don't manage our forest, then we are going to destroy that same environment that we are living within. So, are you convinced this uh, message of uh, partnership between, I mean, the, 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 the public sector and the uh, uh, people and the private sector, is it, is, it, is it going down? Is the message going through? Yes, from the few realities or from our field experience, we see that the population now can actually welcome foresters. Before, when they see the green uniform, even without committing a crime, they take on the heels. And presently, instead, when they see we, they see us coming, they come and inquire, they ask interesting questions. And uh, we have made them known that they are the custodians of the forest. They live in the forest, they do their day-to-day -day activities in the forest, and they have to manage that forest for the betterment of their future. And if they don't do that, then they, they are going to be the very first to suffer. Thus, they are actually accepting this concept and they are willing to participate with the government and other international organizations to manage their forest. Thank you very much, Mr. Bakia. Thank you for talking to us. We'll be glad to always come back to you to find out how these uh, new strategies are, are working for the betterment of the Kamunyan forest. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. I know, um, uh, um, I, one, one point though, Miss Sam, to ask about poor management, we'll talk, we'll talk a bit about it, the, the, the village forest management policy. Mm -hmm. Yes, no, no, <coughs> I want to know also. Mm -hmm.